Beneath miles and miles of the deep blue sea lies mysteries so shocking that people try to ignore that they are real. We've only discovered around 5% of the ocean, which leads to the great question, what is in the other 95%? Today we're going to be taking a look at 10 deep sea mysteries that will freak you out. After this list, you might think twice before getting into the waters on your next vacation to the deep blue sea. Number 10. The Aegean Sea Ruins Greece is one of the world's oldest civilizations, so it's safe to say that they have their fair share of historical sites. But the Aegean Sea Ruins presents one of the most prominent discoveries in recent Greek history. This site was discovered off the coast of Delos in 2014. At first, it was believed to be the ancient remains of an old port, but it was later discovered to be an old pottery workshop complete with a kiln and various pots, along with retaining walls, pathways, towers, and other identified buildings covering almost 12 acres of the sea floor. The media in Greece and other nations have begun calling it the underwater Pompeii. This failed coastal sediment is estimated to have fallen into the sea around 4,500 years ago. There are even some researchers who believe this ancient city may be the city of Cain, where the Athens defeated the Spartans. Number 9. The Atlantis of Japan Around 2,000 years ago, a city sank into the ocean off the coast of Yonagunijima following massive seismic activity, or at least that's what some believe. Just like many other underwater discoveries, the Yonaguni Monument and its surrounding structures have been dismissed by people as a rock formation. This is because the structures are very distinct in their sharp angles, shapes, and columns. This leads to many people to agree that this without a doubt is an ancient civilization. With the discovery of a steppe pyramid that stands 25 meters in height, it's very hard to deny the man-made properties of this structure. According to the local marine biologist, Mizaki Kimura, this may be one of the several lost continents theorized throughout the ages. Number 8. The Baltic Sea Anomaly There are estimated to be 100,000 shipwrecks and crashes sitting undisturbed at the bottom of the Baltic Sea. And some of these wrecks might not have been from Earth. What is known by some as the Baltic UFO, this anomaly was discovered by Ocean Team X, a group of Swedish divers. With a diameter of 200 feet, this structure has invoked numerous theories of what it could be. Some say it's an anti-submarine device, others say it's a spaceship, and some simply believe it's a geological formation. With a shape that resembles a flying saucer, it's no wonder that many people have been quick to assume the most bizarre. Also, the fact that many electronics seem to stop working around this structure only adds to the conspiracies. Number 7. The Cuban Underwater City Discovering an underwater city is always a wonder that sparks the imagination of many. But when this city sits beneath the Bermuda Triangle, one of the most mysterious geographical locations on Earth, crazy theories start to form. In 2001, solar scans off the coast of Cuba revealed a series of distinctly geometric structures. Being that these structures were sitting over 2,000 feet below the water, it's hard to fathom how, when, or why they would have been created. Some experts have gone so far as to say that they've identified pyramids and even a sphinx. Many other fanatics have jumped to the conclusion that this is a lost city of Atlantis. There's been very little to no follow-up on this discovery of the location, leading many to believe that it's being covered up by the world's governments. Number 6. The Gulf of Mexico Shipwreck There may be more than 2,000 known shipwrecks to scatter across the seafloor in the Gulf of Mexico but very few of these wrecks have captured the world's attention as effectively as this vessel. At an estimated age of 200 years old, this ship has been subject to one of the most challenging and complicated underwater archaeological discoveries in history, and the fact that it is hidden away below almost 2,600 feet of water doesn't make the task any easier. It was discovered by accident while putting down an Exxon Mobil pipeline, Quite a few underwater rovers have been sent down to gather information, but all of these attempts have suffered unusual technical failures. This has led both believers and skeptics to question whether this old vessel might actually be cursed. Number 5. The Milky Sea Effect From a scientific standpoint, it can be seen how this mystery occurs, but what no one knows is why. For generations, sailors have described crossing mysterious glowing patches of sea. Being that sailors are known to be extremely superstitious, very little credit was ever given to these tales until 1985, when a researcher team managed to take samples of the milky seawater. They identified this as bacterial found in nature. 
it seems that this sailor tale has some merit after all. Further studies in satellite images give us much better understanding of this bioluminescent phenomenon, which can cover an area even bigger than the size of a US state. The true mystery that no one knows is why the bacteria forms in these patterns to produce the effect that we see today. Number 4. The Colossal Squid The Kraken is a work of fiction destined to stay in the books and on the big screen, but the Colossal Squid is very much real and almost as terrifying. To truly understand just how massive the Colossal Squid is, let's take a look at the slightly smaller Giant Squid, first caught on film in 2012. The giant squid was measured up to be 43 feet long and weighed an estimated 1,000 pounds. Now switching back to the colossal squid, they reach up to 46 feet long and a whopping 1,650 pounds. While the giant squid tentacles have suckers with teeth on them, the colossal squid sport a number of sharp, jagged hooks. There's only been one live specimen ever caught and studied, so there is still so much we don't know about the colossal squid. Who knows, maybe deep enough down there's a squid that would make even the colossal squid look small. Number 3. Leptocephalus gigantis If you already don't like eels, you are in for a bad surprise. This creature was first caught by a man named Peter Henry John Castle off the coast of New Zealand in 1959. This monster measured roughly 35 inches in length, but its anatomy suggested it was still in the larval stage. This suggests that the eel was just a baby. Considering that the Leptophacalus are typically 2-4 to four inches long during this stage, Castle's discovery certainly sparked controversy. Based on his calculations, an adult Leptophacalus gigantis could reach the length of 98 feet once it got fully mature. Many other people have claimed to see the Leptophacalus gigantis, but no one has come across an adult specimen to confirm Castle's hypothesis. Number 2. Surviving Megalodon Encounters while Wikipedia will say that the Megalodon is an extinct species, others don't necessarily agree. Most scientific sources do agree with the position Wikipedia takes, but thanks to the Discovery Channel's Megalodon the Monster Shark Lives, which was marketed as a dramatized documentary, there is a renewed interest in the possible continued existence of this giant predator. With a maximum size estimated to be 59 feet long, over three times bigger than the largest great white shark, ever discovered. Although the giant shark was believed to be deceased for 65 million years, it was rediscovered in 1932, and the 15 foot long megamouth shark was unknown until 1972. So there's still a chance that this monster is still swimming deep below the sea. There has been countless eyewitness reports of a shark larger than 50 feet long, which continues to spark people's intrigue into the story. And number one, the Bimini Road. Almost every underwater discovery has people jumping to conclusions that it's the next Atlantis. But few inspire enthusiasm like this giant arrangement of rocks and stones in the Bahamas. Many have already called this the road to Atlantis. However, it's better known as the Bimini Road due to its location beneath the water near North Bimini Island. Further explorations have led some to believe that a better name for this structure is the Bimini Wall. This is because it runs a half mile long and is made of sandstone blocks. It is one of three similar patterns of rock formations in this area, and it's up for debate as to whether or not it's an ancient wall or truly the road to Atlantis. And no one can quite figure out how the stones were created to form such an intricate and captivating site. Which mystery do you believe might be true? Let us know down in the comments. And remember to subscribe to Top 10 Owl or we'll delete your social media.